I mean, I, I made 2700 last week net. But, bruh, if fuel wasn't so expensive, we talking. Now we talking. 3500 to 4000 a week. Which, at this, I mean... You know what I mean? 2700 is still good money, though, at the same time. You know what I mean? Um, shit. Uh, this, yeah, that's what I was making over at Prime, too. So, it's still some good money being made. Um, but, man, if those fuel prices were to go down and and the rates... What's up, man? And the rates went back up, bruh. Life is going to be beautiful out here on the road. I'm telling you, man. Because what I want to do... Is get my money and get out, bro. Like, real. I want to get my money and get out, bro. I want to get to the point where I can work six months out the year and take the other six months off and give me like a little horse ranch, give me a few horses, a little bit of land, some four wheelers and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Really, that's my goal. That's what I want to do. But. These rates, man. These rates, and I don't know if I'm going back out, back out West Coast, bro. Cause I was out West Coast, and everything coming from like to, to get in there, it pays well. But I guess, but the fuel is so high too. I don't know. I don't know if it's really worth it. You know what I'm saying? Where are all the rates at? Where's the good money being made out here right now? Where is it on it? I, I mean, I'm pretty sure it's. East Coast, mid, mid, east, mid east, like from Alabama up to uh, what, like Virginia, New Jersey, and all those. And I hate going to New Jersey and New York, but that's where that's where you gonna make your money at, man. So as much as I hate going there because traffic is crazy, shippers, everybody, it's like. You don't, you don't get that southern hospitality. You rather get, you rarely get southern. You really rarely get hospitality at shippers anyway because I don't know why it is. It's just it's how it is. They expect us truckers to be like like no emotion, like for people to talk to you crazy and for you to just blow it off your shoulders because because you're a man or you're a, you're a strong woman out here. You know what I'm saying? So, but anyway, but like, but anyway, in New Jersey, but in New Jersey, you if you're not in a fucking truck spot by two o'clock in New Jersey, you're not finding parking, bro. You're sleeping on a freaking off ramp, and trucks are gonna be flying by you all night, every single time. Your truck is gonna go <laughs> all night long. So, so, that's the reason why I don't like going out to New Jersey, but it is a lot of money to be made in New Jersey because it's a lot of people that live up east. Mo mo most people live uh, northeast. Um, this is where most of the population is. And and, and like also Florida, like a lot, lows going into Florida always pay really well because there's no money. Usually when you come out of Florida, you're not gonna make any that much money. But I mean, I can't say on all my loads, I've. At the, at the least, and I always hear truckers say this too, like newer truckers taking uh, like uh, low rates. All my, I, all, the lowest rate I've gotten is two dollars. Everything's been over two, like two dollars and fifteen cents a load. So, but I mean, supposedly I'm in a situation now where I'm uh, I'm connected to get the top rates. So. We should see how that goes. But it's, I mean, it, I don't want to speak on it. We just gonna have to see, and then if it goes well, obviously I'll let you guys know. But what, like, do you got anybody out there, like, because I can book my own loads too. Like, where are the good loads to get? Where should I go? Or is it a good idea to just stay up northeast, like Jersey, New York, uh, down to Florida, um, over to? I really don't like it. Especially Nebraska and Wyoming in the wintertime. Oh, hell no. 
I'm no way. No, 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 no. I learned my lesson last year. They paid me six thousand to go to Washington from where was I? Where was I? Uh, Missouri to Washington during the winter, December, January. Bro, I went through my first blizzard back to back. Two blizzards back to back. They shut down the whole highway. Then driving, I almost lost my trailer. I'm talking about like 20 miles per hour. And I just feel my trailer drifting, right? And I'm just like, oh shit. So I to, like go really, really slow to try to get back in front of it. Barely get in front of it right before I get to the uh the brick wall. Bro, I was like, oh no, I can't do it. Can't do this no more. <laughs> it's not worth the risk, man. It's not worth the risk. So but life is going good. Life is actually pretty, really is going going very well right now. Um, been working out quite a bit lately, making some good money again, so that feels good. Um, that's pretty much, I got pretty much everything I want. I, I'm getting right now. I'm getting loaded right now. But pretty much everything I want, I'm getting, I've gotten shit. I'm, I'm living right now, so yeah. Just gotta keep going, keep pushing, man. And uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go back to Miami soon, man. Anyway, yeah, y'all. So y'all just let me know where where are the best rates at. If you know, what what you guys use to book your loads, and uh, cause basically every my dispatch keeps telling me you're getting the same rates that Landstar is getting, and people left Prime to go to Landstar. So clearly, I'm doing all right. You know what I'm saying? Especially I made 2,700 my first week. Net. So it wasn't bad. Um, so I'm grateful for that, you know. Um, yeah, man. But all right, y'all let me know, man. Put it in the comment section. I uh, hope everything's going good for y'all out there, too, man. Keep rolling. Keep pushing. We on the grind out here, and uh, we're going to keep it rolling, man. All right.